start the recording so we have uh, we have uh, created the formula just to modify the formula we look up if we have the one data that's like name and sales and i i have write the name the repeated time right repeated time okay and we have also write the sum numbers here putting the rand rand between formula and copy and paste as a value remove the formula so uh, we have the formula we look up if you use the we look up formula you can look up your value in the data matching the your giving the criteria right but yeah. we look up look up only for one value right the first value coming here and so here yeah correct but yes. i want to the every formula every value if we, if we have the uh, puja in the repeated time so every number so here to uh, separate with a comma yeah right but uh, we have no any uh, idea and no any way we have the also v list listing and array array method you can look up the all for all value related to the puja but in the different yeah. print sales but i want to in the one cell separating the comma and other separator so we have we have understand the problem and understand the what you, what result we want so go to the developer okay. visual basics insert the modules and remember that every formula write in the module okay okay if you write the formula in the c2 and c2 and other uh, other uh, any anywhere that time problem is that your formula net refer, refer to another sheet if you write the formula in the c2 one that you have apply only for in the c2 one not the other sheet so what, what will happen if you write it in this workbook if you have write the this workbook the that that time is the give you the reference to other sheet to give the complete reference automatic reference what? not pick what a references automatic references not pick just like if we have the write the formula go to the another sheet i click here automatic referencing so here pick the yeah. automatic reference that uh, that will have a problem got a reference of the automatically not pick a second problem is if you write the formula not give the in the auto, auto suggestion so i have, have some problem so i requested please apply the your formula in the module okay okay in the module and for the declaration for formula have a three part for declarations calculation and assignment right first okay. declare the formula as per your requirement so for the declaration formula we have write here functions if you write the macro use the sub sub for subject the yeah, public sub yeah but function right here fun, uh, function and name of the okay. function just like write here function we look up a you can uh, give the any name of the functions and then okay. input in input in the functions just like if you apply the we look up if you apply the we look up in the we look up have a three inputs four inputs look up value the table range column index and look up range like that you can also enter here the inputs ki what uh, what type of the inputs here in uh, enter here so we have yeah. first apply here v as a variant comma r as a range and c as a integer right so apply formula here this like you have deleted the formula apply formula here vla <coughs> select here and select the range and comma 1 so understand here v uh, uh, e3 this like i want to uh, finding with puja in this range and i want to value in the column one range zero and one one range right yeah yeah okay so e3 value is stored in the v in the formula v v as a variant we have defined here in the formula yeah and this area set to the r because r defined as the range and this number is stored in the c c as a integer okay right and we have write there 
also define the one formula dim a as a uh, range and for h k in r right next yeah next uh, next k right here yeah, right here k and we have also defined the one string because our result in the string s as a string then if a uh, k dot value is equal to v we have entered here v then s equal to s and we have combine here uh, dash and and k dot value and is and be fair so we have a uh, uh, two step follow first is the declaration formula we have declared the formula second step calculate a formula we have calculate our complete result stored on the s right but a uh, next okay. third step is the assignment because s is how can uh, stack the formula in cell in the cell because all the calculation are calculated and result is stored on the s but i want to uh, show value s on the Sir, your uh, one minute hold on okay hello yes yeah Sorry, uh, I didn't hear you. What? Okay. Hello. Oh, okay, okay. Can you give me a call after two hours? Okay, thanks. Bye. Yeah. Hello. Sorry. Okay, continue. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, yeah. Continue. So we have a, we have a store the value on the S, right? Mm -hmm. And we have assigned the your final result on formula equal to S. So this formula show the result in the your cell, just like that. Um, can you please go back? Oh, okay. So what S is equal we, to? We have uh, some problem here. We have write the offset and write here zero and here C dot value. Okay, so so here name right here. Right. Every uh, puja cells uh, here uh, combine the uh, combine with comma. Okay, okay. Okay, and understand the code. If any problems, tell me. Uh, so uh, yes is equal to s ambassador comma ambassador what is k okay k is b okay 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 k this uh, i have i have assigned the range right but it is a, this is a club of the range and i want to go uh, check the value one by one in the every uh, range every cell in the r so we have used the for each formula right for each mm -hmm. k in r R is the club of range and K is the single one range. So one by one R give the one cell here and check K dot value is equal to V. V is the your very V is the uh, enter the value just like puja. If match mm -hmm. then then S equal to and uh, with S combine the uh, K offset comma C. It means next column. C it means one. It, it means next column. Next column of the K. K. Okay. This is the K. Next column of the K. This value combined with S. Because if we uh, have applied this is S equal to twenty, and again uh, we have uh, uh, assigned the uh, value thirty, then final result is the thirty because thirty replaced to twenty. But we have here combined here K S, just like that. That time K twenty. Uh, twenty comma thirty. Is that? 
So yeah, yeah. But what is offset zero comma three? Sorry, zero comma C. There, there is no C is the column index number because I want uh, we have entered here that I want to data with one column. Next column, it means one column. Right? Okay. 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 Just like VLOOKUP, if, we, if in, in this VLOOKUP we have entered a column number two, give it a second column number value. So just like that, if we have entered here the column oh, okay. number. Okay. So what? Okay. But we have used the uh, offset in the formula and offset counting from the zero. So here, zero is this column and one is the next column. So this okay. column value so here, and we have a. Uh, Apply the offset because if you do not apply your offset, then only for puja, 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 same column value. If you check here, yeah, if, yeah, I saw that. Ah, uh, puja, puja. So I have mm -hmm. a, I I want to the next column, next column of the k. Yeah. Right. So we have apply here offset and zero. It means row. The same. I want to form uh, the value on the same row, but Next column, yeah, and we have column not decided because column as per data. If we have data in the third column, so we have entered the third and third number store here. Yeah, it's clear. Yeah, and if I want it like well, not in the same row but in a different row, like the next number. Like the first number is fifty four, right? So it's in the first cell, and the second number is in the second cell. It, uh, do you want to first number fifty four here, a second number sixty here, like okay, that? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We have uh, okay. We have uh, created the formula for that. Mm -hmm. So I want to write the name here. Name means puja, and I want to number here. Just like yeah. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, right? Yeah. Okay. So we have applied the formula, create the formula, new functions, and V L um, C V L um, C yeah, V L P positions, and V as a variant, right? And yeah. comma. R as a range, and C as an integer for the colon, and also R C, the so R R W the row as a integer, right? Okay. So we have applied the formula like uh, V L P, and select the puja, and select the range, range of data, select mm -hmm. the column number. And this one position number. Okay, I want to uh, value a first value. I want to second value. I have a third value. So we have enter uh, select the positions. Uh, okay. Okay. So apply the code here. Uh, dim R as a range. And four H R we have entered a K here because R already defined here. Yes. For each K in R, if K dot value is equal to V, then we have apply here one value. Mm, dim, dim, city as an integer. And uh, city equal to city, uh, city plus one, right? Uh, we are also apply our own condition ki if city is equal to R W. Then V L P equal to a K dot offset zero row and C column dot value, 
and here and if or here is the and if and next key right yeah so right here 54 and we uh, freeze the formula here using yeah. the f4 <coughs> right okay okay so value is not showing they get zero yeah Understand yeah, it's the code. Yeah. So for each k in R. Okay, so so can you please uh, yeah, I know you, you taught me range in the first classes. Can you please explain range to me over here? Like whenever you do a loop, why why are you using like two ranges? Like say if it were just coding language, what I'll do is like I'll run a for loop, insert every value into a array and then spit it out spit, spit the array out just, like that's how i uh, like i know this is a scripting language which is different so just just understand we have apply here range here because our input is the in the one range i i have find the number in the one a, 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 one area okay, okay. so in mm -hmm. the x in the vba programming you have we have uh, every value call just like this is called k k1 its range right okay you can assign you can also uh, k1 is the range and you also k12 uh, k10 also the range if we have any uh, require required any input of the range we have used the range variable right uh, because because this is a function a uh, loop is not uh, loop is not here work uh, for loop uh, is not work here we have applied the every time the for each loop because uh, this range will be uh, uh, this range length will be depending on the user data maybe user data 100 the select the 100 row and maybe data is the 1000 the 1000 row and a starting end is not a defined we have also uh, select the range from the 10 number row 10 to 20 also like the 1 to 20 so this is oh. a fully dynamic so we have apply here the range when when user apply the formula select the range just like we have selected a2 to a 165 this range is assigned to this object in on the r because we have defined here r as object if you formula we have entered the range in the second positions this assigned on the r this is the method of vva okay Okay, and we have also created the one range here because this is the club of the range because in this R have a store more than one ranges, more more than okay. more cells, cells mm -hmm. at this here. But I have I have go to the check one by one cell our conditions. Okay, I have checked the one by one cell key is this cell value equal to puja yeah equal to V. Oh, okay. So we have assigned the one day dim k as a range, and we have to uh, apply the for each loop. For each loop is uh, for working from the object. If you have, you have entered any object for in the for each loop, that is do the one by one. If we have, uh, sorry, hold on. Uh, so you you have given one range that I. That because you say because the input is in the range and why have like the other range the K as range that's because we because, have to write the this, output this, in the range as well. This range is stored, just listen to me. This range is stored as a more than one range, right? Just like club of the range, but we have required we have required check the uh, condition with one by one cell, one by one range, not a club of the range, okay. right? Okay. In the if, okay. just like if you if you apply the if formula in the if formula you have select the one range not select the club of the range. Okay. This is the wrong. If you select the a two say a thirteen is the wrong, but you have select a two is the correct. Yes. Like that here we have required for the one by one range, but we have entered the 
club of the range so separate one by one we have assigned the one again range here and uh, is this range is in the for each uh, loop so we have right here for each k in the r so r okay. give to k one by one okay okay so k, okay. because r ha r have a lot of, r, r have a lot of range lot of sales yeah but k uh, but, but for with for each k receive at one time one sale Okay. Okay. Just like that. If we have select the one range, but we have typed the number in the only for one cell. When the pressing yeah. the enter, we have uh, get the again again range. We yeah. have the right here again range, but we have yeah. select we have select the uh, one selected, and we have uh, if you number place any number, uh, not not good out to this selected area. But in this selected area, we have entered the anywhere value. Anything do with this selected range, like that okay. we have uh, uh, stored the uh, lot of range here, one selected range here, and do with one by one in this for each loop. For each loop, I have also explained the uh, for each loop classes. The for each loop do with the object, the say worksheet, workbook, and ranges. You have give you the lot of ranges and give the again. One or uh, another uh, object like range and do with the one by one. So for each loop, so when I when time, I write when I write this for for each k in R, what is the termination condition here? When will the loop finish? When the loop finish, if R R R, R is uh, complete the range, the loop be finished. Oh, okay, okay. As long as the range of R, okay, okay. Hmm. Okay, you have range. If you if, if you select the give the range uh, ten ten of the cell, so uh, your loop will running be with ten. Okay, how how uh, uh, how many times run your loop depending on your object? Okay, how many objects okay. stored in the your object object variable? Okay. Okay, the R is the object variable because range is also object. Yeah. So we have stored the ten number of uh, cells on the R. So for each loop, uh, run the ten times, and every time one by one cell address assigned on the this variable. Okay. Okay. If you uh, if you run uh, step go to the step one by one, then uh, see the formula. Like first assign the a one, a two, a three, a four. So we have apply here that if k dot value is equal to v. Then we have applied the uh, add the one count here CT, right? And check the yeah. condition if CT uh, uh, CT value CT I have stored this is like one, two, three, four. Uh, this like uh, how many be the conditions apply here? The number and every time check that uh, CT the value is equal to RW. If you don't both are the equal, then show the value on the formula. We have okay, just so like just like we have entered the third, third, enter the third here. So first check the puja, get the puja. So we have assigned the one number. CT is the one, but we have entered the third on the RW. So CT is not equal to th th three. So skip this, skip this uh, condition and next go to the next loop. Again check. Again, again check here. If R W R K dot value equal to V, it means uh, puja. And again, as stored the value on the C T. C T uh, last time we have stored the one. Again, uh, that time we have stored here again one. Then C T. Uh, uh, can, can you please go back to the formula for a minute? Yeah, right here. The, 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 yeah. Uh, so, E10 as in what is E10 here? Eat in this number third. Uh, oh, that's puja. Okay, now eat. Oh, what? what six, okay, six, yeah. So six puja. What is eat? the name of the persons? This is the reference. The address of the data. This is the column. Which column we uh, want to show the data? And this is the positions. We have puja get get the five time, but I want to the third time. Third puja. Third puja oh. value. So this is the number number of positions. Oh, okay, okay. So you're running one loop for like the yeah, right. sequence number and the other loop for the position. Uh, yeah. yeah. The first first condition first condition meet the puja, and we are 
assign the one value which will be here because how can count ki uh, how many times puja get yeah so we, but we have because we have uh, 10 times 10 times the puja but i want to eight eight number at puja so how can i identify ki number at puja is made so we have uh, we have here uh, add one value ki if we if we any condition met with puja then we have store one value here yeah right yeah yeah and yeah. check the condition if we storage value is equal to our times our position times that we have uh, show the value ah uh, okay okay rw is the position time okay yeah rw is position time right yeah okay okay okay, okay. okay. Yeah. okay. we have uh, created the one formula if you uh, down uh, if you uh, see the our new uh excel we have in the uh, last few months launched microsoft launched the new excel excel 2019 and uh, excel 2019 have a one formula concat call what concat c o n c a t yeah right ki i want to uh, concat the every value in the one cell just like that ki we have we have uh, n percent com uh, Again, uh, like the next value, and percent. Again, the next value, and percent. Next value, like that. Oh, okay. Okay. So join the join the text join the text with the and percent also concatenate also have a formula. If you use the oh, formula okay. concatenate, and select first value, second value, third value, and fourth value, right. But problem is that in this formula you have entered the in this formula you have entered the cell reference one by one. You can't mm -hmm. enter the one area just like we have concatenate and we have assigned the area. So if you uh, assign the area, your value will not be concatenate. Ah, okay. Okay, so concat formula have a uh, a new concat formula in the two thousand nineteen have a features. you can select the one range and combine the all value uh, like what you've done before like puja neeraj yeah right so we have uh, but uh, we have used the 2016 now and 2000 lower versions so how can you use this formula so we have create we have no formula this form not this type of the formula so we have create formula with vva okay because we have also told you ki we have uh, uh, three uh, you the three requirement for the use excel function first customize the formula so we have customized the formula and yeah. second second is the create the new formula if you have something to want and no not any uh, formula available in your applications you can create so we have we want to concatenate the your selected range in this yeah. form in this uh, workbook so mm -hmm. we have created the formula Write your function and uh, on get, and we have entered the the range as a in as a range, right? Okay. And also apply the formula dim r as a range and for each r in n. Next, <coughs> R, and we have also apply the one S as a string, right? Okay. And S equal to S concatenate with R dot value, right, sir? Okay. and after that we have applied the con cat equal to s right con cat and yeah it, this is the equal to s why do you write con cat equal to s we have the three oh. step of the formula na first the uh, assign them assign my assign the formula sorry uh, mm -hmm. calculate the uh, uh, declaration of formula calculate formula and assign your result ki we have stored the result on the s yes, but but if you not uh, assign uh, store your final result on the your formula name 
formula formula result can't be so Okay. So this is the this is the very required. If you calculate formula and store the every result on the one variables, and this variable store this variable value is stored on the your formula name. Every formula we have do here. Check here. We have also VLP. VLP is the formula name, right? Oh, so you have to always assign the output to the yeah. formula. Yeah. Right. You also have VLS equal to S. VLS is the formula name. right yeah okay so concat equal to s so here check here equal concat and we have select the range but okay. problem is that ki uh, again one formula in your 2019 in text join text join formula is similar to concrete but in this formula you can give the separator ki within puja or neeraj have a once only any separator that is just like a space comma dash slash any type of the okay. separator okay and what's the other one text join formula name is the text join okay in the 2019 have another formula name is text join this formula similar to concate concate only for com uh, combine the your cell value no give any separations right oh, oh, oh what what's the difference between this and that because uh, this, this is a puja and with con text join value you, you have give the one separation just like a space just like a uh, comma between one cell value to another cell value uh hold on what is it i don't i don't get it like i don't get the difference between this concatenate and text join so it it concat formula like... concat formula join only for two cell value not give any separator oh okay only just like just cell. like you have you have we have the uh, name just like uh, any person like just like jack Dishuja, right? And okay. if you have concatenate formula, concatenate only for with concatenate formula, we have concatenate tag Dishuja, oh, right? Okay. But okay, I want it. to, I want to give the one one separation, just like a space between Jack and Dishuja. Okay. So with text join, you can do that. Oh, okay. So okay. We have also created the another formula text join, similar formula like concrete. Yeah. Right. Change the name here text join. And we have uh, enter here one another uh, separator uh, uh, she as a string, right? And we have enter s and uh, she again and here. And formula name change here. Text join. Right. And okay. now, if you have text join formula apply here, select the range and give you your separation. Just like we have entered the comma. After the pressing enter, see here. Oh, okay, cool. Right, but uh, yeah. one problem uh, in the every formula, my every example have a one problem. Just like we have entered here puja, and in this uh, 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 we have entered here VLA functions. Enter yeah. here uh, starting from the comma, and also we have entered the textual function starting from the comma. But yeah. this is the wrong one because yeah. I have not uh, want to starting from the comma. This is the unnecessary comma. Mm, yeah. So first understand that this comma why do we appear here? So we have see here we have used the s concatenate with uh, separation and r. So yeah. if you have a loop first time do here s is the s is the blank, nothing is stored in the s the first yeah. time. Yeah. So first time is the blank and the comma and your value store. So simple. You have also uh, apply the your uh, Excel worksheet formula. Just like write, write, select the value, 
and apply the formula ln and minus one. Apply this formula, press the after enter, you got here. Result, we remove the dash before the starting your result. Right, and you can uh, also, we have simple apply, right? We can go to the, extract the value from the right. How the First, understand what is it do with right? If you have uh, type the any numbers, I want to any text lecture. I want to I want to extract the right side of the three character. Okay. So we have used the formula right and select here. Give the three numbers. So right formula extract the three number of character from the right side. Clear? With right formula, this is the Excel worksheet formula, not a VBA formula. But uh, oh, okay. this formula also support in the VVA. Okay, okay. Okay, and we have the another formula. I have a length. Length is the count of the complete length. Ki how many character enter in the cell, this cell L three? The seven. So we have apply okay. a formula. Ki if we go to the D seven and extract uh, extract the uh, from the right side. Then a right formula asks the number because we this is the number part. We have gave the number three, four, five, six, just like enter here. But I have no idea how many character. Yeah. How many character Hello. in the cell? This cell. So we have apply the formula len here. Len formula complete count the complete length, including the yeah. first comma. So we have enter here key uh, len results. Uh, minus one the lane results because we have uh, stagnant number key, uh, number from the right. You know how many characters uh, total number just like we have total number of character hundred. So I want to extract the ninety nine. Yeah. So we have minus. Can you do? Uh, so you can do that the length for right, left, top, bottom. The right. No, not a top, bottom, right, left, and mid three formula. Okay. So we have also apply a uh, formula right and lane s minus one. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So give the another example. <coughs> right. So uh, in India, have a uh, bank holiday on the Saturday. Not every Saturday. Bank say ki every second Saturday and last Saturday will be off. The bank holiday. So if we have entered here our uh, starting of the date, month date, we have first December. And I want to show here ki first uh, sorry, uh, second Saturday. And last Saturday of a month. In the month. Oh, okay. Okay. Because in the Excel, no have any formula. Ki how you uh, calculate the how uh, second Saturday date and last Saturday date. Simply, but uh, with array formula, you can calculate the multi. You can. Uh, apply the some complicated formula and get the extra result. But this is a very complicated formula, and uh, everybody can't apply that. So yes. I have I want to create this formula with VVS. Every person which apply the simply, right? So apply the function here. Function uh, we have. Uh, ext date name formula is the ext date and apply here. What is start as a date and the uh, d days as a and also apply a days on d as a string and and as an integer. 
right um okay so we have applied the formula here e x t date select the starting date of the month apply the days we have applied the saturday and which saturday second saturday clear hello man any problem in this formula uh uh we have a we have a same declare the formula like this is the start date this is a saturday week week day because we have uh, uh, another uh, time we have required the calculate the second tuesday so we have just change your uh, saturday to tuesday and get the result and this is the time you your first second day second saturday third second day how many times we want to yeah 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 apply. yeah i got uh, yeah thanks i got okay. it so we have apply so uh, a to value assign on the st and saturday, saturday assign on the uh the range uh range the range, d d is a string range is not required oh. yeah? yeah 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 sorry yeah okay. and number 2 assign on the n right so we have apply the formula for i equal to st 2 we have the formula one formula in the excel uh, just mm -hmm. like e o month is the end of the month excel formula ah oh, yes if if you apply this formula in excel formula we calculate the last date of the yeah. ending month so we have apply here e o month but e o month formula not supporting the vv how can i identify because jab when the apply the formula I start the break and expression is not coming if you apply uh, any excel formulas just like i we have apply the formula right and apply the uh, enter the break it and so the expression here it means this formula support to the vva but e o month okay. formula not support the vva because when the uh, we have uh, enter the formula and enter the break it so expression is not coming so which formula yeah. not sub directly support the vva we use uh, we use to call from the function function library so apply here application dot worksheet function dot e o month and apply here st comma 0 and next i and you think if we use the uh, we have used the for i loop and this is the give the live st to e o month why because st is the yeah. date this is the not a number this is the date yeah. So yeah. think that he in the in the Excel if you if you enter the date so store as a number, right? So we have give giving the loop starting from forty three thousand four hundred thirty five to forty three thousand four hundred sixty five. Okay, so we have give the for loop here because yeah. have a data as have also date but. The with Excel have date as a number for store as a number format, and we have apply here condition if format yeah I comma triple D. If you apply the in the format I I have the numbers and number it means date, and we have apply the triple D convert to the date. Just like Saturn, SAT, MON, okay, TUE, yeah, yeah, and equal to we have to apply a D. Then, if a uh, date is uh, the, our every date we uh, equal with our entering date, then we have uh, apply one here um, variable dim R as a R D uh, uh, C C oh. C as a integer. Counter c equal to c equal to c plus one, right? I apply the formula that if c is equal to n, then e x t 
death is equal to i and and if and here is the again add if okay yeah read out no okay so we have apply the formula and get the result mm. but result in the number format but i want to result in the date format so we have if you have right here as a date i think so that as a date okay. but i think not not so no 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 uh read here uh yeah you have apply the format formula for okay. net and date and we have the dd slash mmm slash yy right so format convert convert this i number to dd mmm yy and the this formula clear yeah so any doubt in this code no no, no. that is fine okay so we have a no, a next next formula if we are, we have uh, one to the last date last saturday right so we have apply here com comma and paste and ext i will um, here apply here last lst last and we have not required to number because the final we have last date and also we have not apply this conditions we have delete but we have apply here uh, dim r as a date for the result and we have apply here r right hello yeah oh, yeah and and the and the after the uh, loop we have assigned the formula lst mm. date to r so here because we are using like a inbuilt function Okay. Yeah, I have. I we have we have given the conditions. Keep format i triple d. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got Every it. Every yeah. time will be replaced. This is the first time. Check the first Saturday. First Saturday, then replace. First Saturday, we have entered the date. Then sec yeah. if met second Saturday, so replace first Saturday to second Saturday, and third yeah. Saturday, fourth Saturday, and last Saturday. The last time we have stored this value, so our result here. Hmm. Check here. Yeah. LST date and a start date here, and we have entered the Saturday. Enter. Okay. Got the result. Right. Yeah. So Nati December, you can also check with your calendar. He at mm. December is the second Saturday. Is that correct? Yeah. And nine twenty nine is your last Saturday. Is also correct. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, give me the another example. Yeah. Yeah, right. Uh, we have one example on that. We have write the name here. We have to write the data here. Okay. It's like uh, when they are sending data from your tally and another software. We got the result just mm -hmm. like that. It's like name Sujit Kumar address one zero one slash one. Uh, Delhi, mm. and also mobile number double eight zero two five seven nine three double eight. Also website www dot 
iptindia.com and also have a email id kumar at the rate iptindia.com yeah right this is the yeah. data we have all, uh, l l more than thousands and hundred data yeah yeah uh, i'm listening i'm listening okay yeah So how can I apply here? Because I want to extract the email ID. I want to extract the email ID from this data. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, but mm -hmm. no have any formula for extract the uh, email ID. But we have the also formula just like Sujit, my my name uh, Sujit and Kumar mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. Right. So we have applied the code here, just like find. Find give the space comma this text comma one. So give you the seven number seven number character position of the space. So we have right here left formula left select here and seven minus one because till seven have a space. So before that okay. space. Oh, okay. Okay, and also right for apply the right formula right here. And give the complete length minus your space. So Kumar, <laughs> but in this okay. formula have a only for one space, but in our yeah. data have a mo many many space. But we have the one condition that our email ID is the last position, right? Yeah. After the last space, we have stick the data, but in Excel, not have any formula to calc uh, to uh, uh, get, get the number of I mean, understand the last space. We have the formula uh, find for the first space, but not any formula for last space. But in VBA, last time I give you the one uh, article link. In article link, have a formula uh, reverse. In STR yes, reverse, yeah. With any STR reverse, you can identify for your first space and first correct any character, yeah. and last any character. In uh, STR have a first character and any STR reverse have a last character. Yeah. So we have apply the function here, function uh, last. And as a string, right? Mm. And apply the formula here. Uh, dim r as an integer, and r equal to in str reverse equal to. Enter here. Uh, we'll figure uh, just like n, comma, space. Which one to the character here? And with l s t e equal to right. Yeah, right. Right. The, in the n, comma, in the complete length with n minus the your last the r. last your space and you have got the result here uh, e lst last yeah right select and okay yeah and we have also one formula related to this type of example. He, mm -hmm. One time we have copied the one uh, database, the, the website database, right? Data what? Website database, web, web address database. Oh, okay. With web address database, we have entered this like uh, 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 email ID that is www.iptindia.com, right? 
right? And okay. we have also formula just like Gmail, right? And also formula is the Google. But with uh, hyperlink, we have apply here hyperlink www dot gmail dot com, right? How, how how did you get to the insert hyperlink? Uh, hyperlink in the insert menu bar have a hyperlink. Oh, okay. Yeah, right here. Hyperlink and shortcut is the control plus K. So we have apply the shortcut. Right? Yeah. Right here. So we have a, lo a lot of more than one lakh data like that. So uh, uh, first data is www.ipdindia.com. This is the complete web address. But okay. second data is the Gmail. Gmail what? Gmail dot com, Gmail dot in dot co dot in dot org dot us dot as dot pk. What? Yeah. yeah. But in the hyperlink, we have we have the complete run. Right click here and edit mm -hmm. hyperlink. We have got the result here. We got the our complete URL here. But uh, yeah. we have the one uh, more than one lakh and two lakh row of the data. So if you have one one two more than one lakh row of data, we have more more than one lakh web, uh, web database. So every yeah. cell we have go to the edit hyperlink and copy the complete path. This is a very big job, and I think uh, more than one week take the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we uh, in in Excel have a, no any formula for extract the. A hyperlink address in the another cell. Okay. Right. So we have write the VVA fun functions. 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 I think mm -hmm. uh, URL. URL name. Give the function name URL, and and as a range, right? Mm. And url is equal to n dot n dot hyperlink and here zero i think not zero zero dot add this simple give the what, one what, line what does this mean n is the your range when apply the formula when apply the formula just like uh, url formula we have select the one range and after uh, sorry we have the one with the got the error we have the right here one right right here okay the, the, on the uh, on the n range this is the hyperlink one. This is a property. Add this the property. So we have a strict property, just like C dot name. If you have write write the code, the uh, R equal to sheets dot sheet one dot name. Yeah. Okay. Uh, sorry. Name. Active workbook dot name. So active workbook name assigned on this variable. So yeah. just like that, we have under write the code N N mean. And uh, enter the range in the formula hyperlink. In the one is the index of the hyperlink and address. So uh, hyperlink this cell hyperlink in the store on the URL and URL function name. So your URL address URL address on the cell. Okay. 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 The simple method, but I think I have suggest mm -hmm. to give you. So you have understand ki what is the formula, and how can yeah. I apply the formula? Uh, can you please go back to the function again uh, the, for this one? Yeah. So hyperlink one as in what? What is that hyperlink one? What is the index of index index number? We have because we have apply when the apply hyperlink is the index. Hyperlink number. is like hi, hyperlink is like uh, inbuilt function, right? The inbuilt functions uh, we have apply here one. Index number. Yeah, what does it take? What, what, what? Why do you have to apply one 
And what happens if you don't apply one? Well, with hyperlink, have a carry with hyperlink carry the um, uh, multiple uh, criteria, just like you you have added the hyperlink. So with, mm -hmm. with hyperlink, we have the multiple criteria, just like hyperlink and what well on the show, right? And where the mm -hmm. locations. So we have the multiple uh, information in the hyperlink. So give by one by one information you can show us, yes. right? Okay. So address one one work. one is the one is the address address. It means URL address. It means it means URL address. Is the path the hyperlink path? What? Path path. Oh okay. And that's it, like inbuilt, yeah. That's like in middle. Okay. Okay. So I I, I say, uh, you understand the function. Yeah. Okay. So we have given mm. two example of the function. First, mm. first is uh, we have uh, modified the your in will formula, just like we have applied the VLOOKUP related example. Mm. We have created a new formula. Your uh, uh, depending on requirement. Yeah. And third is when you write the code, and we have uh, uh, multiple uh, choices. We have one one formula used used in the maximum time in the your macro. That time we use the formula. Okay. So I give you the one example for that. Right. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, yeah. Wait a minute. I think the example is suitable for you. Okay. Sorry, what? Wait, wait a few minutes. I just think the example. Ah, uh -huh, sorry. Okay. Okay. I give you the usual form example. No, oh, usual form example. P I have. Mm. Okay, give me the example. User for example. Okay, so I give you the one user for example for this. Mm. So we have a, go to the insert menu bar or click on the user form and we have this mm. the user form. So this is the toolbox. We have yeah. select the tools and as, uh, up, uh, draw here and make the one okay. user form. So we have uh, there the data here. Right. So this is a name, city, and amount. The simple data. And we have enter here the. This is the chair. This is the text box. We apply a text box for the name. Apply the same text box for the city. And apply the text box here for the amount. Okay, so the, it is clear. Yeah. yeah. Okay, and select. Sorry. Move here, and we have also level for the heading of this text box. Yeah. Enter here. Name and also again draw here enter here city and also here amount. Right, and we have the give the uh, command button first command button for the submit second command button is the clear and 
third command button third command button here for the new for the what new 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 data entry right oh new mm. and change the user for title from the your property sheet here right here uh, okay. data entry so uh, when the uh, when we run this micro so here we have entered the name enter the city and amount when the click in the submit your data fill one by one here when you okay. click if you write the wrong any data click here to clear all defects uh, or yeah. clear all uh, uh, your text box yeah, all the data. Yeah. and if you click on the new also give you the new text box clear the everything or check the new, uh, give the new text box both are clear and new or both are the same yeah so we have write the code here first command button one dot click and we mm -hmm. have write the formula uh, the seat seat five and seat five is also property name also seat five so right here sheet five what? dot range why is it sheet oh okay the, the form is seat five corps name and property name both are the same dot and xls up dot row yeah, xls up dot offset offset one comma zero dot value is equal to me dot text box one dot value me is the active form copy paste me is what active form the active sheet active workbook just like me for the active form user form ah oh, so, oh, okay uh, text box 2 and text box 3 there and when when i submit the data here just like puja city is the delhi and amount is the 65 so place the submit if my data is entered but my sales sales will be not a blank so we have write the code here for the blank your uh, text box so writing here yeah. uh, me dot text box 1 dot value equal to blank right okay and 2 and 3 right and also oh, okay. i want also we have want to press press on the clear button so right here the clear uh give the message here msg box your data is clear right then then what what is the click button to spot save i thought click button to is for to clear the data yeah right either by mistake type here msg box right here your x box no we have not required for the message and we have also right here new command and apply this same code so see here uh, mm -hmm. when the uh, when the uh, use this micro uh, right here uh, when this use micro we are write the puja and uh, name is the how did you run this micro because it asked you for that um... mumbai check see here we have write the code on the submit button click so when the click on the submit button your micro will be run your data is saved and your data will be also clear but if i have write the oh. wrong any wrong data and i want to press on the clear the data will be clear also 
right? Mm. And also yeah. we have uh, uh, write the fill data, but I want to new data. So click here, your new data will be prepared for the new data entry. Yeah. Okay, we are also clear. How, how did you run this macro? We have uh, this is not a macro. This is a user form. Okay. So how do you run this user form? Uh, for the user form run, we have a sign here. If we have uh, give any micro through my run with through micro and run through the button. Okay. Okay. The first go to the modules. I clear the one micro just like uh, a sub run user user form, right? R U N user form. Like open and close, and you go see over here. Uh, user, sorry, user form one dot show. Right, and if you want yeah. to, if you want to run through uh, micros, so go to the run the micros here, and if you want to roll through the button, so right, uh, draw here a button, and assign your micro on the button. Right. Oh yes. Clear. Yeah. So click on the click on this run button. The user form will appear. Yeah. Hold on. Up, up yeah. now. Now I give you the example for the repetition repeated uh, code with uh, is, oh. do the uh, one, minute, one minute. One minute. One minute. One minute. I'll be back. Just just give me two minutes. Okay. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah please click, carry on. click on the button and see here. If we have the one code text this this line the three line of the code also in the yeah. command button one. All yeah. same code also in the command button two, and yeah. same code also in the command button three. So yeah. one code we have write in the three times. But yeah. here, here is the only for three line of the code. But maybe uh, in the another macro have a ten, twenty, fifty, sixty, and hundred time lines of the code, and you have mm -hmm. do the repeated and repeated and multiple times. So okay. if we use the function here, add here function. Function and name the clear CL bracket open and close, and put the code into this function, right? Okay. And where the required this line of the code, we just call this function. Just like uh, any uh, any on variable because your function not you run without variable, so need to variable. Just like CL, right? Is the code oh. a equal to CL? Like it open and close, and also here. Yeah. So you don't have to declare a. You can declare if you not declare the automatically declare as a very variant. Oh, is it okay? Okay. Mm. Right. Yeah. Okay. So uh, I uh, give you the third uh, third requirement of uh, functions. If we have one code. One multiple line of the code, and you want to use this uh, code in the multiple uh, uh, user from the multiple in the user form have a multiple uh, uh, objects and and also in the uh, your uh, micro different different micros. We have also apply the as a function. So you have reduce the time, reduce the code, and reduce the size. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Correct. <laughs> That's okay. Great. Yeah. So now uh, you have create um, need to create a sub macros. So I give you the some questions. Yeah, Ready yeah. the macros? Okay. Yeah. So first to save this file and send to you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. 
Functions. And we have the lot of questions in the L2, right? <coughs> okay, see here. Hmm. Oh my god, you got so many projects today. Right. Okay, see here. Question number one, I have also told you, between date, within two dates, need to calculate how many Sunday and how many, uh, how, how many uh, Saturday. Okay. Okay, so create the formula, how many Saturday and Sunday in the between of the date. Yeah. Second question is, we have, we have this question also also give you uh, give the, uh, an example if we have the month starting month i want to second saturday of the month the last saturday of the month okay yeah. i i also in the uh, today we discuss about that uh, question number 3 okay question number 3 is just, just uh, uh, understand okay, we have a start a start one project on december at uh, december 10 december Right, on yep. time is uh, twelve of today uh, day. That means two p.m. Or well, this this project and on fifteen December, two thousand eighteen on six p.m. on the evening. Right, our yep. shift is nine to eighteen. After the shift, I I don't do the do on the project. So how many the working hour of project? What say again? Uh, the start is ten. Uh, we have to take the take the oh, one okay, project. You want the hours. Huh. I have take the project on ten December two p.m. and finish the project on fifteen December on eighteen uh, six p.m. Right. Okay. Our shift timing morning nine a.m. to evening six a.m. six p.m. Yeah. So how many time uh, work with this project? So calculate the exact working hour. Sorry, this is a spelling mistake. Work, working hours of this project. Yeah. Okay. Question number four. We have the numbers. I want I want to sum up the this number. It's like one plus four plus two plus three plus every numbers sum sum in the one cell. Yeah. Question number fifth. We have the one data with decimal and also the number. So we have uh, combined the every character with dash separator. Just like S dash D dash F dash one in the all character. Every slide oh, okay. we have my write the Sujit name. So uh, enter here S dash U dash J dash E dash E dash okay. T right <laughs> okay question number six yeah. question number six we have the data we have the data no, five is enough for now. just, just I understand this is the simple questions just understand we have the data is a s d and we have in the data we have the numbers and character also I want to extract yeah. number one two, uh, only just like uh, uh, one two three Right. Yeah. And so yeah. zero you can also yeah? one two three. And question number seven, we have the data. My data have a ID name, ID amount name, ID MRP name. So our uh, th every uh, third data, every third data have a any figure. But uh, okay. our heading will be changed. Just like some where the amount, some where the MRP, some where the prices. Right. So not a fix. Yeah. The amount, prices, anything uh, enter here, but position is the fix, the third, okay. first, okay. second, and third. So create the formula for the sum of the third number of row. Okay. okay. Question number eight, the simple, count the how many unique value and how many duplicate value. How many unique value and then what? How many duplicate value? Oh, duplicate. Okay. D 
for duplicate, U for unit. And question number 11, we have entered the data here, right? And when they enter yeah. the data, we our last data. So here, mm. just like so with this like we have to apply the Excel formula. But I want to do with VVA. Okay. Okay, so, I don't know if I'll finish all of this, but I'll try. Okay, so this is your yeah. function example. Do with this example. And yeah. okay, uh, to, yeah. uh, next, uh, tomorrow do you, uh, do you join the class? No, not tomorrow. Uh, Friday, I, so I told you that like, Thursday I have other plans. So uh, next class Saturday. Okay, I wish. Yeah, Saturday. Uh, yeah, if your internet works fine, hopefully. <laughs> no, no. Every day, every day, not the work too. Because uh, yeah. on Saturday, I have a function. Uh, our uh, landol function on on the our uh, uh, top oh, of okay. building. That's like. Okay, let's do Sunday then. Yeah. Ah, let's do. No, no, no. Saturday, not last Saturday have a function. Not it today. So last Friday have a function. So one people, uh, any, 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 any F one children, our antenna will be moved to another position. So internet not connected. Oh, okay. Last Friday night have a part uh, have a uh, uh, my landlord child have a one functions on the our uh, building. So. And many people, many children are coming. Many uh, the landlord relate, relatives will be coming and go to the uh, top of the building, and maybe some some children uh, we move our antenna to another position. So we have the oh. lease line, Airtel lease line. So signal will be not completely, so the internet not part. But I book the complaint on the afternoon will be fine, but be fine. So today, uh, this Saturday, we'll do with you. But before, before the Saturday, try to solve this question. I have sent to you. We work only on the weekends uh, on, on the projects. Try, uh, to, yeah. try to solve yeah. because if you try these fun functions, you have um, command on the functions. And also, uh, uh, because uh, function like, is the method. Every, every, uh, every programming language, the VB language, if you do the sum uh, form functions uh, as, mm -hmm. as a practice, you have command on the video programming. Uh, so this Saturday, can I do three o'clock? Like you said, Sunday morning, you want you have to go to the. Okay, but Saturday, if you want, can to, if you want to on Saturday on uh, evening, okay, somebody, I give you the training on the evening. Okay, yeah, because morning I can work on it and evening I could okay. do the class. Okay, thank you. Okay, cool. Okay, awesome. bye. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. And